sweet people. Welcome to Canvas Crafts. My name is Kim and if you're new here, hello, welcome. If you're returning, welcome back guys. Love you. Uh, if you are one of my ride and dies and you've been here before, you're going to notice that this is a little bit of a different setup. I have my Josephine wall on my desk and I just did not feel like moving it off to make this video. I told myself I can't move it off until I finish that and uh, ninth row and I'm almost there but I wanted to make this video real quick before I head it out and edit it for you so I can have it up today so it is Wednesday it's happy hump day hump day people and I have been dying to get into these packages I was like I cannot wait another day I cannot wait another day and um, you know how it is you order some stuff and you have to wait for all the pieces to get in this, these are not linked in any way for a project. These are just multiple little small shop haul things. So we have pens and we have washi. How many pens? Well, let's find out. Okay, so first bag we're gonna go into, as you can see, this says Stationery Pal, all about stationery. So this is gonna be the washi. trying to cover up everybody's address oh oh wait I was wondering why this thing was so big oh we got lots of goodies in here so I don't know what that is unless I did order that and I didn't realize it and I know I didn't order him but he's adorable oh my god he's so cute you could make him a cover minder <laughs> if you glued a magnet on the back of him. I won't do that to him, but he's adorable. And so this is Stationery, Stationery Pal, and it says, thank you for your order, Stationery Pal. So it's a letter to me. There's a coupon code in there, but um, yeah, it's a letter to me. And let's look at the washi. So these two are the same. And remember, I get these for specific canvases. So this is the washi that I picked out for one canvas that I have in particular. And it's like a Japanese theme. It's very pretty. So there's two of those. I think I've learned that I don't really need to buy two because I don't set the washi all over the entire canvas. I don't know what that noise is. And then we have these. So how pretty is this? This is very thick. I think I knew it was thick, but it was more the pattern that I was looking for. And this I probably did need to because there's not a whole lot on these rolls. So two of those. And then Love in every shade. Okay, and then another coupon code. So I don't know, did I order? I'm thinking maybe I ordered something by a, I don't know. Let's see, what is this? Oh, cool, study things. So I did not order this. This was a gift and this was a gift. These are some kind of pens. How do I open? Ah, open here. Very cool. So I got this gift from them, and there's two, four, six pens in there. And I just took the wax off the tip there. Ooh, they write nice. They're very nice. It's like a gel ink almost I guess okay so that is what I got from stationery pal I'm just gonna put that aside I'm just gonna move this over and I'll bring it back let's get into this one okay this is what was in the box nothing else and it's from leopard leather works 
So here's the information. And I'll, I'll definitely link everything below. And this was on Facebook. So it came in a bubble, little bubble sleeve. And this was a hand-turned pen. And it says, thank you. We're wild about our customers. I'm a very bad look at the blank and figure out... Um, how did they, oh, I'm a very bad look at the blank and figure out what it's going to look like. But I got this for a specific canvas and it is, it's really going to match well. It's really pretty. So there's a little bit of like a jade and gold on this tip. Don't mind my nails. <laughs> um, and then we go into like a coppery burnt orange, reddish orange tint, and then some black down here. And there's even a, a hint of blue. And it's all with a clear. And again, I don't know if it's resin or acrylic. I'm not that good, but it's very pretty. And I think they said something about not glossing their pens. It's very smooth. Um, I think I don't remember like the shapes, but I always, I never go for a wide grip if I have the option. So this is, this feels very comfortable in my hand. Super pretty. So I have a um, canvas in mind for that pen. And then these pens, pens, so you already know it's more than one. Ooh, fancy. I wonder why one got a fancier thing than the other. These are for, from, uh, yeah, them. Say plus Bulatours. Say, say plus Bulatours. That's what I'm going with. And I have to tell you, I, this was, I had to, I, I like put my name in for a different one and I didn't get it. And then I put my name in for this one. This is so pretty. I'm just noticing some extra like little detail over here. I was just looking at it through the camera. So now I'm looking at it head on and it came with a single placer and it fits nice and snug on both ends. I love that. Okay, so let's do the the not so fancy one. And when I put my name in for these, I got both of them. Now I only put put one in. Oh my goodness. Wow. This is really pretty. It reminds me of Sherbert. And it feels really good in my hand. Now this is um, glossier. This is more like a matte finish. And this is like a, I don't know if it's, they're different. Again, I don't know if they're different materials, but very beautiful. So very different colors, right? And this is so cool, this tube. And it's another one of these velvety cases. Ooh. It's got like a little honeycomb thing going on. Yeah, that is beautiful. Is it the same um, pen shape? No, they're different pen shapes. They're both the glossy type. Wow. So pretty. I don't have anything like any of these. 
So they're all very different. And I'm, I'm trying to keep track of that. Like I don't want to order anything that is too similar to the other. And when I first started diamond painting, I was like, I'm not going to collect pens. Like, why would I need so many pens? And here I am. I just bought three of them. <laughs> oh, my God. I love them all. I can't wait to use them. They feel great in my hand. They're a great width or girth. I love them. And again, these came with plastic tips. I don't know if you're able to ask for metal tips, but I have my own metal tips. So yeah, that's my small shop haul, guys. It's just a short video. And there's like, I don't know if you can see. Well, there's this red in there, but I was looking at the purple and like the glittery. Again, I'm trying to look outside of the the camera too because I get a little more detail. So that is my small shop haul. I got three pens, one from Leopard Leather Works, two from Ses Plus Ses Plus Bulatours, and then I got these four washi from Stationery Pal, and they gave me these two gifts for my order. And that's all I have for you guys. Everything will be linked below. These you have to like put your name in and get picked. Um, I was the only one that put my name in, so I got picked by default on this one. But for these, uh, I guess they put you in like a random name picker for whoever, like if this was E60 and this was E61, um, whoever put their name in for E60, they get picked, and then whoever put their name in for E61, they get picked. These were two different days. They weren't all in the same pile. But that's all I have for you guys. If you enjoyed this video, if you wouldn't mind giving me a thumbs up on the way out, and if you want to see more from me, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and join the family and friends here at Kim's Crafts. I would love to have you. You guys have a wonderful, wonderful day. Take care. Keep diamond painting.